Etno Kreša 2016. deseta izdanja kreće službeno sa današnjom večerom. Pomalo sam uzbuđen, ali opet jako sretan. Super. Nos. People from all over the world, young folk musicians are able to meet and to share music. And the beauty of ethno is that you don't have to know how to read or write music, so everything is taught by ear. So you really just have to listen and play, and this makes it uh, in a very communicative. So what, what could be just to Fun and good and hands will let off free, and then you have the Fun good and hands will let off free, and we're ready for a little It starts again with the paparam. Operation. Hard work. I can't take it anymore. <laughs> yeah, it needs recovery. Oh. It's too much. The pressure is too much. <laughs> I can't have this anymore. Seriously, I'm burned out. No food. Oh, it's just working. My back is killing me so hard. <laughs> One glass of water the whole day. <laughs> It's really like specific uh, kind of um, camp because uh, people people have just like so uh, little time, but somehow every time when there is the ending, like you can feel this uh, kind of communication that everybody feels that they are together. Like I think it's nice just to like feel each other.
I present Ethno Croatia 2016. Thank you for being here. Ethno Croatia, right? What's nice about it is it's uh, one of the smallest ethnos that I've worked on. So you get to know quite a small group of people and you spend a lot of time with them for the week. We have wonderful Nenad organising. He always knows what he's doing. Oh, it's a dummy, on it? On it. Oh, yeah. No, no, no. no. Oh, yeah. introduce it to new people and you, we only have five days to prepare so it's quite a lot of work to make sure it is good enough for a concert and then do five concerts in a row um, but uh, luckily we have such a great team of musicians that yen dva, yen dva. Oh, 